Sarah Logue here, joined with Sarah Fieri. Thank you for joining me here in beautiful Tyendega in Burlington, Ontario. We're here to talk to you about the market and where it specifically stands here in this community. It's great to get a local market update on how your home's doing and the values around you are producing. Sarah, I'm excited to hear how Ty and Dag has been faring in this very changing market. We've really changed on a dime since March, and there's a lot of information that people are asking us for. I'm hoping you can educate the people of Ty and Dega a little bit about their home values. Absolutely. So in terms of the values of detached homes here in Ty and Dega, they are still sitting very well. Nice. So the average sold price for Q2 thus far is just over $2 million. Wow. Which is a fantastic increase from where we were Q2 in 2021. The average sold price was sitting around $1.43 million. Taking into consideration though too, the houses that we're seeing today that are selling have been updated. And that's what our buyers are really looking for. They're wanting something that's a little bit more turnkey. Why do you think that is? I think it's because when you look at the process that it would take to update some of these older Tyendaga homes, and as we know, most of them were built between 1970 and 1990. Fantastic, large, detached homes here in Burlington, ranging from 2,000 up to 4,000 mm -hmm. square feet, four bedroom, five bathroom. It's a lot of house to renovate. It is. And so the young families moving in, Think about how much it, time and money it would take to renovate these homes. So when they're coming and they're looking at the houses, more often than not, they're choosing the ones that have already been updated for them. Okay, so a lot of the pricing that we're seeing is coming in on renovated homes. If I'm a mature homeowner and I've lived in my home for over 20 years, I'm probably not going to be wanting to spend that budget and or live through that renovation. So there's obviously two options here. Yep. One, to compensate on price, knowing the high values around you are keeping your neighborhood nice and high in value, mm -hmm. right? And two, you have a great option that you've been working with some of our retirees and seniors on that is working great to help give that picture to the younger buyer. Explain a little bit about it. Absolutely. So in part of our listings, what we can do is actually provide virtually renovated spaces. And what I love and everybody likes the best too, it's not just a picture of a renovated space. We actually do a 360 degree around the room of what these renovated spaces can be. And taking it one step further of actually providing those contractor quotes. So when we're speaking with buyers, we have the plan laid out, they know what it can cost, and sometimes they can even actually roll that right into their mortgage. Perfect. So what I'm hearing clearly that we're seeing in Ty and Dag, and it seems to be a trend that we're seeing in North Burlington throughout our business, is that prices seem to be maintaining off of value from about two years ago, right? We're still in a positive. We're not seeing the chaos of multiple bids and the mass price climbs that we were experiencing early in the year. Right. Um, but the reality is there's no opportunity anymore to go to market with, let's call them, house faux pas, right? You've got to be prepared to compensate in the marketplace to give people an option on how to deal with those things, whether it's by a better price or by making those changes. Absolutely, and it's educating the sellers too that in January, we were seeing homes sell in five days. In June, we're seeing homes sell in 17 or more days. Right. Because we are not seeing the same number of showings, we're not seeing competitive multiple offers coming through, and so that's where we're seeing the big change in the market, especially here in Tyndaga. So set the expectations. We're not looking at multiple offers. We're looking at conditional offers. Yeah. We're often looking at one offer, right? Mm -hmm. Generating how we're getting that offer. It's not going to throw just show up on your driveway anymore. Mm -hmm. um, and what you need to do to ensure that you go out of the gate strong to capture that one offer. Absolutely. Okay. So what would be your message back to the people at Ty and Dega as their next steps? Uh, that Ty and Dega, definitely still a great market, great value in the homes here. Um, a special pocket, especially in my heart, when you think of it in Burlington. Absolutely. When you consider the mature lots, the tree-lined streets, and all of the amenities that are around. So working with sellers and working with buyers, absolutely love working in the Ty and Dega neighborhood. You get incredible pockets like this right in the middle of your community. You it's do. absolutely outstanding. Yes. If you're looking for a true value on your home and how the market's changing right now and how those impacts your price, please reach out to teamlogue.ca.